Hello, I'm Richardo. This time uh, I will show you uh, installing air cooler and the setting USB boot uh, for the Asus TUF B450M Pro Gaming mainboard. Right? Okay, this is the mainboard uh, for the Asus TUF B450M Pro Gaming. Right? Hey, uh, as you can see that uh, 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 this picture show you that uh, she must clear uh, uh, RTC RAM, right? Uh, if you have some problem on the computer, uh, you can short uh, by two pins. Okay. okay, this label of this uh, this marker. Alright, uh, this is the CPU uh, for the AMD Ryzen 5 3600X. Right, the back side of the CPU. Okay, uh, now you uh, can see that the specification of the air cooler. Okay, uh, this is the uh, made by the John Small. The model name is CR1000 uh, White. Okay, now you can see the dimensions and the size. Right, hip pulp uh, 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 has the four PCS. Okay. Uh, also, TDP supported uh, under 130 watt. Right. Okay. Uh, this the uh, fan, cooler fan, uh, uh, support to the Intel, uh, the spew, and then the uh, AMD spews. Okay. Okay. This is the pan of the CPU air cooler. Then uh, this picture uh, is the anchor uh, for the fixing the fan to the base. Okay. Uh, this picture uh, is the back side of the cooler, a uh, base with a quad heat pipe. Okay. Okay. This front side of cooler. Okay, the anchor, okay, as you can see, is hung on uh, both holes of the fan. Okay, the anchor was fixed to the core base. Okay, the other anchor uh, was also fixed to the core base. Okay. okay, power cable also needed to prepare. Okay, okay it's done. For the air cooler. Okay, uh, as you can see, this is the back side of the main board. Right? Okay, uh, the, the right side, uh, there are the, the bracket uh, for the, the air cooler. Uh, you need to place the bracket on the board CP cooler. Okay, like this. Okay. Okay, then uh, the top side, uh, you need to uh, apply the thermal paste uh, to the first, to the CPU first. Okay. Uh, then uh, put the air cooler on the CPU. Okay. Uh, uh, before fixing the fan to the cooler base, uh, uh, to firstly tighten the screws. Okay. Also, uh, you need to the, the tighten the screw to on the back uh, side of the cooler. All right. Okay. Uh, the air cooler is mounted on the board. Okay. Let me show you that uh, how to uh, set the USB boot on the BIOS menu. Okay. Okay, uh, on the advanced mode, uh, this is the main uh, tab. Okay, now you can see the, the watch the uh, CPU and speed and then total the memory. Right. Then go to the boot tab. Okay. Then uh, you can go to the boot option priority. Then uh, select the USB as the first boot device uh, under boot option priorities. Right? Save all settings. Okay. 
Okay, this, um, uh, then uh, 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 let me uh, explain the, the other way uh, to set the US booting. Okay, this is the easy mode. Alright, click the boot menu. Uh, this is the hotkey, is the F, uh, F8, right? In the easy mode. Then uh, there are uh, uh, a couple of uh, boot devices. Uh, then uh, just click uh, on the device. Okay. So now I clicked send disk. Okay. okay uh, put it into getting started for the disk computer. Okay. Uh, and you can see the window uh, logger. The USB was recognized as a boot device. Right. Okay. Setting was done. That's all. Thank you for watching this movie.